this in it. It was like winter. And uh, it's rough when it's cold and you're taking a cold shower. But since today was hot, and it's already like 10 o'clock, it definitely wasn't bad. It was actually refreshing. I've been taking cold showers on and off for about the past year. However, I've been taking them consistently for the past three months. I've been taking them every single day, every single morning, and let me tell you about why I take them. So I guess the first and major reason why I take them is not for the health benefits. I'll get into the health benefits later, but I take them for the discipline. I listen to Tony Robbins sometimes. Let me show you a clip of him in a podcast. Every morning, I don't miss. And there's never been a morning I look forward to it. It's never. So but, but I'll tell you why you I do it. Wim Hof? I do, well, I know Wim Hof really well. Yeah. But I do it because besides the physical capacity, which, you know, you limp flow, your blood flow changes radically. Yeah, right. It's the discipline of saying, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. I'm like, I don't go and say, oh, when I'm ready or when I, it's like, when I say go, MFR, we go now. Year over year, I set these big New Year's resolutions. And at the end of the year, I'm one of those people that, find, that finds out, oh, I didn't hit my goals. I've been tired of not achieving my goals that I set for myself. I've also gave up on businesses that are doing well, but I was just checked out and in general, just not seeing things through to completion. I mean, one prime example is this YouTube channel itself. I had so many goals for this YouTube channel and I'm sitting here at still 100 subscribers. So discipline is one of the biggest things on my mind. That's also why I've kind of been uploading more and I want to stay and maintain consistency. So that is the main reason why I take cold showers. My discipline has been weak and my willpower has been weak. And so this will just gradually increase the challenge every single day and make sure I stick to what I say I'm gonna do. Another reason, and this one is more obvious, is the health benefits. Cold showers have been proven to decrease swelling and inflammation. I've had experience with inflammation and swelling as I've had acne, which is a symptom of that. And I've had horrible acne ever since high school. Now I basically have no acne, but I used to have really, really bad cystic acne throughout my entire face. For me, even though my acne has gone away, I know I still have a lot of inflammation. I think one of the main reasons is because I've, I'm always hot. I'm like literally always hot. In like Indian culture, I believe I'm a pita, which means I have hot blood and I have a lot of, again, inflammation and heat in my body. A cold shower is just a great way to kind of have more balance with my body and I significantly feel a lot better uh, after every single morning. One other benefit that I like from cold showers is that it wakes up the lymph node system. And so when you take cold showers, it basically helps circulation, gets your body kind of moving. And again, for me, this is important because having a great lymph system can flush a lot of toxins out. I know I don't really treat my body the best, like sometimes I eat fast food, sometimes I drink a soda or whatever, but all these are toxins for your body. And so me just increasing the lymphatic system really just helps flush it out easier. Uh, here's a picture of me now versus a year ago. But another health benefit of why I take cold shower is that it really helps sh shred the fat. Apparently cold stimulation stimulates the healthy fat while burning the unhealthy fat. And I've definitely seen this change Although I still work out every single week, uh, for me, it allowed me to shred faster. There was a little period in my life where I was, I had kind of like a belly, not like crazy, but a belly for me. And just after taking cold showers, I didn't work out any more than I did before, but it really just helped shred you a lot easier and a lot faster. And although that wasn't why I originally started cold showers, it's definitely an added benefit. Lastly, I took cold showers because of the no fap challenge. After failing the no fap challenge a couple times already and trying to learn from my mistakes each and every time, I realized that cold showers were essential for me to stay on no fap. I don't know what it is, but when I take a cold shower, basically all my horniness just goes to zero, which is really, really nice, especially if I'm working throughout the day and it's just really, really useful. Times before I took cold showers, I've always had the urge to do it like midday or just some random time. But for me, like the urge literally goes down to almost zero and it's been so nice, especially like kind of as a hypersexual person. At first, I didn't know why people were telling me to take cold showers, 
but it really it really it just really works i guess for the body it really shrinks the blood flow to just your like core extremities and therefore you don't have blood going to your area if you're taking a part of the no fap challenge i think it is beyond essential to start cold showers as well there's so many benefits and zero negatives it just takes a little willpower and for you to just go for it so these are the reasons why i take cold showers every day try it for a week i promise you you'll feel so much better every single morning with that being said i appreciate you watching please give this video a thumbs up and uh, i'll see you in the next one